3000, just, just shout them out, y'all. Whoa, 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 this your boy Logic X3000 LCE, we in the building. Now, Hollow the Dawn drops another bomb on the battle rap community. He um goes to Instagram and he leaks his contract, which stated that URL paid 26000 for him not to battle murder move on RBE. Nigga, what? Twenty six bands, not the battle. Like that's crazy. So now, you know, Hollow the Dawn is frustrated because um he want residuals and he wanted a few extra thousand to battle Rum Nitty. So apparently. Hollow the Dawn and URL could not come to an agreement. Um, Hollow could not get them to budge and get what he was trying to demand in this contract. So now, you know, the no up situation has sparked everything. And Hollow, he's, he, he's speaking out. He getting in his bag and he, you know what I mean? He, he putting it out there. Now, we all know URL has blocked battles for RBE, allegedly. It's the first time somebody actually came out and said it and put, put everything on the table, what was actually going on behind the scenes. So, um, like I said before, you got artists speaking out now. You got the artists that was speaking under the post, um, under some of the posts that Hala was making. You got some battle rappers taking certain sides. You got some battle rappers who don't want to say nothing because they don't want to mess their money up. You know what I'm saying? So there's a lot going on right now. And one of the things that I was thinking, you know what I'm saying? For our, for our funeral, spoke about it on the program Mac Mel Show. Make sure y'all tune into that because it's always spicy for real. I talk how I want, and when a nigga tell me you can't give me the yeah, and you say, I right, cool, and when you find out some backstory, listen to all of the fans of the culture. I'm speaking for the battler. When you hear someone tell you they don't got the bag, and you know they got it, but you can't go and yeah. So you still take a battle for the low, low bowling yourself. When you find out niggas is out here paying Rari money for niggas to take sick days. Look at my eyes when I'm talking to y'all. When a nigga say they don't got the bag for you because it's in the budget. It's not in the, it's too much out the budget. And then when you see niggas is just getting paid to stay home, are you shitting me? Let me check my drawers. Nigga, what? I got a couple clips for y'all. But um But yeah, Fur, she was she was she was kinda thinking Fur was kinda thinking the same thing that I was that I was thinking. Like if you are L pay hollow the dawn of money, would he have came out? And told everybody about URL paying them twenty six thousand to not battle on RBE. Would he be exposing all this shit right now? That was a big thought in my mind. You know what I'm saying? Let's check out what Fred from the roof said real quick. Now is the time. He out here putting it out there like, I mean, but it is kind of fucked up to know that. He did get paid to block the battle. So he's just as much 
a part of the bullshit as they are. Because if you were so for the fucking culture, it would have been like, yeah, you know, I mean, but money is green. And you can spend green everywhere and even in between, all right? I think that's the difference, but like, you know, when he like, at this, you know what I'm saying? I got a kid. If you pay me stay home money, 26 to stay home. But you know what the crazy part is? He, it said 50,000, but 52. For 52, but you only got 26. To stay home. You got 26. So that never happen. Yeah, you got, but listen, I wanted the whole 50. If I'm not going to do this battle, give me the whole fucking 50, all right? See what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, if you was so for the culture, which you really have let this be known, if you would have got what you got, you feel me? So that's all I'm saying. But, I mean, y'all know how it go. When shit go down, shit goes down. You feel me? So, I mean, but yeah, yo, uh... Hollow the Dawn went to Instagram. After he dropped the contract, he, he went to apologize for putting the contract out there. And he stated, I want to apologize for putting out that contract. Right is right, wrong is wrong. Them blocking battles has nothing to do with my argument. That was an emotional decision I made. He displayed a, um, a DM message that he had with a fan. And, um... Which asked him the question that I was thinking in her funeral that she was thinking. And he said he honestly had some reflecting to do. Because when he was getting paid, what he felt was good. He didn't speak up. Even though other battlers was getting jerked. He said he was going Damn. to keep reflecting. Because if he got what he wanted, he would have let other battlers suffer pretty much. And... He considered himself a leader, and that's not what leaders do. So, I congratulate Hilo for acknowledging um, what everybody was thinking and what some people addressed to him, you feel me? Questions they had. So, I'm glad that he, um, you know, put that out there in the universe, you feel me? Like, that's some, that's some real shit right there, for real. Um... So Joe Button, he went to his Instagram in defense of the battlers as well. Because, you know, the controversy that he going through with different companies. And it's all pretty much the same when it comes down to it. He went to say, the man who invented the bundle package only to be stopped from using it. It wasn't standard. Same bundle package implemented by most artists labels today. Talk about theft of generational wealth. His fam fought over his estate while people for the rest of eternity will feed their families off his IP. Ye needs his masters back and the board seats. The battle rappers need in on the caffeine deal. New century, new era, new technology. With the same tricks from the same people done to the same exact people. At least respect is enough to update the scam. Shake my head. Pac said he might not change the world, but he would inspire the mind that would. And Nip said, it's a marathon, so I hate to break it to folks, but this is how I'm on it till I'm gone. You don't gotta like it, just get out of the way. It is what it is. Um, Yeah, man, much respect to Joe Button, too. Kanye, you know, he been on Twitter ranting, you know what I mean, dropping contract at the contract at the contract. You know what I'm saying? Like, 2020 is the year of exposure. <laughs> and shout out to my man in the comments. He always be saying that shit, too. I forget his name. But 2020 definitely is the year of exposure. This is something that got to be dealt with. You feel me? Uh, And until the battle rappers can really come together and unite and, you know what I mean, stand tall, put their foot down, this is going to continue to keep going on because you're going to have battlers that still want to be in that certain position or still want that shine. Yeah, you know I mean, still want that promo. You feel me? And take that little bit of money just for the, you know what I'm saying? The glitz and the glamour, you know what I mean? Um, but when it all come down to it, get your business right. Have your business right, you know what I'm saying? Negotiate what you feel that you're worth. And, you know what I'm saying? 
if you can't come to agreement to that, then, hey, say no. You heard? And for y'all that feel that y'all can't go to other battle leagues and things like that, I mean, it's up to y'all, man, at the end of the day. Um, me personally, I wouldn't want my brain tarnished like that. Um, you know, you got your certain contracts that whatever the case may be. And I'm sure battlers be scared to go to these other leagues because they feel like they won't get booked on URL no more or they will never get booked on URL. You know what I'm saying? So stop tarnishing your own brand. But, uh, yeah, yo, shit crazy, man. But, yeah, yo, it's been a lot going on. So much, really, to be talking about. For her funeral, she also discussed the female battle rappers, how they are treated, how they are underpaid. Um, And, you know what I'm saying? Just how they treated the worst out of everybody. You know what I'm saying? So, and she says she been putting the bug in female battle rappers ear for a minute. But, you know, certain people just want to listen to what they listen to. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you can't, you can lead the horse to the water, but you can't make them drink it. That's what they always say. You feel me? Um. So, yeah, let's check out this last clip from her. But. I'm going to sign out. It's still a lot more I could be talking about right now, man. But, you know, I got some shit I got to do. So, I might drop another blog later on. Um, But, yeah, man. We almost said 3K. 3,000. X3000 LCE, man. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to all the subscribers out there. You know, if you're new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button and that notification bell, you feel me? We out here. You know what I mean? Like, so he's just a part of uh -huh. the bullshit as they are, if you want to be technical. Okay, you showed us this. They cock blocked the battle. This is why you didn't battle this person. But what about your morals what about your standards if you so if you so big on the culture and shit and you feel like they doing something wrong then why why you ain't let them keep their little money and do the battle then you know what i'm saying so it's like one hair washes the other you was a part of it yeah. you took the money and you ain't say nothing probably you probably ain't even give who 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 league that was supposed to be on gracie's I believe it might have been RBE. Oh, well, RBE or whatever the case may be? I think they probably blocked off. They don't care really for nobody. Like, they competition. But let's, let's call them. They competition with RBE. Call a spade a spade. I hear that. They competition with RBE. No one else got that bad for them but RBE. Right. Right. They okay. Probably we underpaid. Second of all, ain't nobody giving us no motherfucking twenty six thousand. They ain't even giving us a thousand to not take a battle. They just cock blocking the shit off the arm. Like she ain't battling over here, or y'all not doing this battle, or calling battlers like, oh, if you take that battle, you can't battle over here no more. And females are doing it. Mm, mm. We don't get paid tens of thousand dollars. Unreal. You know what I'm saying? We just, well, not we, because you know, huh, nigga, I'm a mother. <laughs> I'm a 10 stepper. I does what the fuck I does when I want to do. Uh -oh. <laughs> like, the fuck? Like, I does what I want to do. Uh, it's a lot of females in battle rap that. They, you know, they they want to be a part of Queen of the Ring, so they gonna they gonna do whatever it is that's told to them, so they can stay on the brand. You feel me? So that's how that goes, and that's the sad part about it. You feel me? Because it's like you want to be a battle rapper so bad, you allowing a motherfucker to tell you you can or cannot go to this league because. We not booking you over here no more. You understand what I'm saying? Or you potentially book a battle 
in another league and then next thing you know the league owner is calling you like oh well we gotta cancel this battle because x y and z was x y and z and you know what i mean and first of all well where's the fucking coins since y'all stopping my motherfucking bag give me the motherfucking coins you know what i'm saying where's the money where is it so first of all we underpaid overworked and we don't even have the fucking sponsors for this shit and y'all want to stop a bitch from traveling and get into the bag and then and then when they do get to the bag you consider disloyal you know what i mean You ain't got no money, you fucked up them bands, the fuck is you saying? Can't hang in the hood, I'm good in the hood, the fuck is you saying? Feel better when you come from nothing, I ain't had to ask a nigga for nothing. Still toting pistols, thugging in public, the fuck is you saying? Hood niggas 